Hello again, everybody. We're back with another soldering kit from ProtoPick, and this time we're actually going to be focusing on a nightlight kit. This is more of an intermediate kit rather than some of the other ones that we have, which are beginner or SMD or more experienced ones. So it is good to have a little bit of knowledge about soldering and assembly of larger scale kits before going into this. And before we actually start soldering and showing you how to build this, I'm going to recommend that you grab a rubber band first because it will help in the long run. So that way you don't have to go out and grab one while you're in the middle of assembly. We're going to focus first on the bottom panel, which is where the LEDs, the resistors, transistor, light level sensor, and the USB adapter are all going to go. Uh, so we won't need to worry about these five other panels right now. And first we'll start with the resistors. We're going to start with the 39K ohm resistor. That is the one colored orange, white, orange. And the way that you want to do this is that starting off with the resistors, the LEDs, and the transistor, they're all going to be on this inside level of the box. This is going to be the outside. This is the part that's facing down outside the box. This is the part facing up inside the box. Uh, next, we're going to cut off the leads and then just go right into soldering on the other five resistors. Next up, we're going to do the transistor. And there is polarity on this one, but just make sure you pay attention to the silk and you'll be fine. Now that the transistor is soldered on, we're going to move on to the five white LEDs. All the LEDs do have polarity, just like normal. Make sure you pay attention to the silk on the board because there will be a little flat edge on the LED silk. Just pay attention to that on the actual LEDs. Next up, we're going to attach the photoresistor. This one can be a little bit tricky because we are going to insert it from the bottom up. And you don't want to insert it all the way in because it's going to hang off the side as well. We're specifically putting it on the outside so that it gets better light level detection instead of it being on the inside and it almost always being dark. The last component we're going to solder on is the micro USB adapter. And this is going to go on the bottom as well, just like the photoresistor. Now there is a bit of SMD soldering as well, so make sure that you are aware of that before soldering this piece on. Now that we've soldered all of our components to the baseboard, now we move on to the construction of the housing around it. Remember that rubber band I told you to grab? This is when we're going to use it. So to assemble the housing, we don't actually need the base. So let's just set this aside and not worry about it for right now. What we are going to do is we're going to go ahead and assemble the housing in a T-shaped pattern or plus shape. These are the five pieces of the outer housing. White indicates inside, whereas the black indicates outside. All right, I'm not going to lie. That actually did take a lot more time than I was expecting. But I want to stress, use a rubber band. It will help you in the long run and be patient. All right, last up, we need to put the housing over the baseboard. Best way to go about doing this is to turn it upside down. Make sure that it cools down first because that heat radiates through the entire thing after you're done soldering. And it's done. We've completed our nightlight. It did take a little bit longer than I was expecting, and that's okay because it is meant to be an intermediate kit. So do make sure that as long as you have the tools that are necessary, including the rubber band, you should be fine and it should give you a pretty good challenge at your intermediate skill level. So if you're wanting exactly that and you are comfortable with doing everything that we showed you today, pick up the nightlight. We've completed it. Next up, we're going to do the... Why? And there is some silk... Uh, bah, 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 bah. Do the transistor. It's not hard. Make sure they have some inner... Instagram post. <laughs>